everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Jade, also known as the Starbook here on YouTube and Instagram. So for this week's video, I have invited a special guest, as you can probably tell from the title of the video. My fiancé is gonna be here joining us in the shadows. <laughs> to rank basically his favorite and least favorite handbag in my collection. Julian, do you want to say hi? Hello everyone. So what we're gonna do is he's gonna pass me the bag that he like or dislike, kind of switching back between the two and talk a little bit about why he likes them or why he doesn't like them. So hopefully you guys find this to be interesting. So let's start off with the first one. So probably, this is probably my favorite bag right now you have. Mm -hmm. It's uh... Oh, it's very classy. I like the, the texture of the, of the leather. And uh, yeah, I think it suits most of what you wear, because what you're wearing right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so for my viewers, this is a Kelly 25 in cellular shape in box leather in black with bladed hardware. And I know you're always very careful with it, because that leather is particularly fragile. So. Yeah, exactly. Is there a particular reason you picked this one out of all my like Kelly 25? I think it's the only box leather one you have, so yeah. it really it does stand out. And I like how the green reflects the light. Mm. That looks very classy and with the, the color of the hardware as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's good. Well, I also really like this one, so I'm happy you picked it. Let's put it away. What's next? So when I don't like it, looks like a toiletry bag. So something you put your toothbrush, toothpaste, go travel with. I can't believe you wear <laughs> this outside. No, but you know I wore the white one on our vacation. It has a strap, right? Yeah, it has a strap. That, that makes it more... Obviously, when I just see it like this, I can't imagine it just being held in the hand. With a strap, maybe. But, but it's cute, and then you wear like crossbody and it's like small. Yeah, I don't love small bags. Yeah, I know. You have a thing with small bags. Mm. Guys have pockets that they can use. <laughs> <laughs> so this is too small for you to be a bag. Yeah, it's only really a bag. What about like the color? Like, is it just the fine. size? Yeah, it's the no. it's like the format of it and mm. also the look. Very toiletry bag like. Great. Okay. Yeah. Fine. I really like these. They're cute. I'm not the one wearing it. Like, yeah. As long as you like it. Anyway, you look, um, you look good in anything. Anyway. Oh, that's so cute. Anyway, this is a mini bullied. You guys have seen it in my collection video. Color is blue room. Next. So let's switch back to something I do like. This one. Mm -hmm. Which you don't use very often. Because it's white. What's wrong with white? <laughs> I mean, I got to use it. No, okay, first of all. Okay, back track. I got this as my engagement bag, but we were moving, like I was moving between Paris and London, so this bag wasn't really with me. So I didn't really wear it last summer. By the time I settled down, it was like winter. I can't really wear it. Also, it's not safe to wear Birkin in like Paris. Fair enough. But I like it. What about during your trip? It's too big to That's bring. True. I don't know. It's yeah, it's different. I, don't know. I, I like the color, the the shapes of Birkin, right? Mm. And the, yeah, the little horse. Pegasus looks, uh, looks cool. Oh, even though it's called a Pegasus. <laughs> it is a Pegasus. Oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> it's not the name of the product. <laughs> okay, yes. It's called a Rodeo Pegasus. Anything mm. else? No, I think so far I like the pretty classic colors of black and a white one. Yeah, yeah, that's true. The third one will go for hybrid. <laughs> yeah, that's true. So, yeah, that's it for this one. Next. Well, I don't like this. What brand Why don't is you this? like this? Yes. What brand is it from? Take a guess. It's only like Celine. Yes. It's from Celine. I don't like the pattern of it. It looks like what I told Jade earlier. It looks like the, <laughs> the free bags you get in the plane. What plane gives you a bag that looks like this? It just feels like that. Probably because it's canvas that you don't like it, no? The pattern itself. Oh, uh, babe, this is like a classic Celine pattern. Just you just don't like the pattern. I don't like the pattern, no, and I don't know. There's not much it's... contrast between the sides and the front. And it's cute. I can see why it's usable. <laughs> So like it's you know very casual, mm. but like among your other bags, I don't like this one. Okay, for me, <laughs> this is one of my favorite summer bags. Like in one of my other videos, saying that this would be like one of the bags I recommend to somebody as their first luxury handbag because it's very versatile and it's not expensive. It looks very usable. Very yeah, good. and it's like super summer and like the gold leather detail and white canvas, mm -hmm. and it's like durable. Like water, anything, get on it. Like like you won't really have to worry about it. So I like it. But I understand so you don't like it. It's a Celine Ava bag. 
So there's actually a lot of versions of it. There's like this, there's a, like the old monogram, which is darker. And then there's also fully leather ones. Okay. I, I, I might prefer darker. Maybe that's why I don't like the pattern. It's a bit too yeah. nice. Oh well, okay. That's, that's, that's for this. What's next? I mentioned another bag I like, which is mm -hmm. sort of the hybrid between mm -hmm. light and dark. Yeah. Because it has like a, a different color sides and handle. Yes. Do you remind me of the colors? This one is, on the front it's grey, so it's actually the same color as the Birkin. Okay. And on the side is trench. So it's a kind of like beige-ish color. And, and this is like a custom order? Yeah, it's a special order. Oh, I got it dirty. <laughs> It's a bit different from the other two because it has a, it's a gold hardware. Brush gold hardware. Brush gold hardware. Yes. Yeah, it looks, I mean, it's very unique. It mm -hmm. looks pretty cool. Like, between these two, which one you I prefer the box. I prefer the box. Sure. Like, it's just the leather. The box though. just looks so classy. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah, so this is Epson, and obviously Epson doesn't like shine the same way as box leather. But you said it's more durable, so yeah, it also makes sense definitely. both. Yeah, no, because like in the rain, I could never wear a box. But like if I'm traveling, like if I have an Epson leather bag, I don't really have to worry about it, which is nice. Isn't it cool? It's like two colors, like inside this as well. Oh, inside that yeah. keyhole? Yeah, it, it's... It's two colors. And, and it has it has it has engravings. The inside? The inside is white to bag. It's not the same as like the no, other ones as well. No. I mean it depends. Usually they use your dominant color you've chosen for the bag for the inside. And then these ones are just the same color inside out. Okay. And then you can special order bags to be like a different color of the inside, but that's like a special thing. So what else can you customize on a special order? Basically everything. Let's go to the next one. Last one. Last this one. this one is so painful. I don't, like I don't understand why you don't like it. Just tell me why you don't like this one. I don't want to say. I don't like the fact that it's like nude. It's a skin color. It's like the classic Chanel beige. Like everybody wants this color. Like what outfit would this work with? Like like white. If I'm wearing like camel color, anything that's like beige, white, summer. No. Oh. It looks like a human skin bag. Human skin bag? <laughs> Did you just say human skin? Yeah. Whose skin is this color? Could be someone's. It's like... It's like it's, a foundation color. Yeah, but it's not like a human color. Okay, what, what else beside the color? What do you not like about it? Is it just the color? I think it's maybe the contrast between the fact that it looks very classic. I think mm. it is like a classic It's a classic color. flap. And then you have like a, a strange color on top. It doesn't like complement it, nor contrast it well. You like my black one. Yeah, so the black one is obviously very classic, but I okay. think you have one that's like slightly turquoise or something. Yeah. Like that. And that's like a nice contrast to the mm. classic. It's the classic <sighs> shape. Okay. So yeah, that's that's all of them. Oh, yeah, you should ask your viewers to, to rank it. Yeah, what do you guys think? Like since we didn't do any rankings among these. <laughs> That's true. Like for me, these are probably also my favorite. And maybe, I mean, three is too little. <laughs> for me to like choose, like it has to be like five or like ten. <laughs> it's like almost everything. <laughs> no, but like, okay, maybe five. These would probably be in the top five bags that I would choose. But if it's top three, I think I would just keep one Kelly and then like include some other style. Yeah, with the third one I was hoping. Like you have the, the smaller ones, the constants. I think. Yeah. I, I think those are cool. So yeah, like I like them Among too. the most usable yeah, exactly. bags you have. Yeah, they're very practical. Definitely, I agree with your choices. You have good taste. I mean, you wouldn't have a bag you don't like. Yeah, I one. know, but I don't understand <laughs> on this side. Especially the Chanel. I know. I think it just values practicality, like how easy it is to mm. have different outfits. So what do you guys think? Like, do you guys agree with him about these particular bags? Or you're gonna fight him with me <laughs> about the Chanel Classic bag? To be fair, like, the sitting is one of my, like, most used summer bags. So I really like it. I agree, it's very usable. The Chanel, I don't use as much, but it's like a real classic, so I really like it. It's more like a collector's bag. Exactly. Okay. And then the mini bullied, I've always really liked them. I agree they're a bit small, like 
My most used bag will probably be like Kelly 25 or like a constant mini, which fits a little bit more than that one. But would you want me to sell any of my bags specifically? Mm, do, you do what you want with yeah. your bags. <laughs> no, but usually they ask the hubby like things that will match or like let go some of the bags. No, you have no? your dedicated <laughs> space for your bags. <laughs> Yeah. As long as it doesn't uh, take <laughs> it's a second uh, cupboard, it's fine. It's starting to. To be fair, you don't have a crazy collection of shoes. Like, imagine the combination of you had lots of shoes and lots of animals. Babe, that would just I have a lot. lot of shoes. You do? I do. I you just store them? them away. You just never use them. Yeah. yeah okay, get rid of those <laughs> shoes then, if you ask me. No, but it's like in college, I really enjoy collecting shoes. So I got a lot of like heels, remember? Sorry, remember. But then, that many, no, I have like maybe like Ten? 50 pairs of shoes. <laughs> We no, I know because when we're moving, I have to declare how many pairs of shoes I have. So, okay, if you ask me what you should get rid of, I only care about how much storage space you use. Mm, okay. And how much you use those things. Yeah. I'd say get rid of all of those shoes. Okay. I think the bags you, you appreciate them more, mm. either as pieces you use every day or as collections. Yeah. That's like true. Items. The I shoes you really too. like. Number one, like you get the shoes from like ninety percent of them. <laughs> nice. And yeah. second, you put them in storage and never use them. Mm, no comment. That's true. Okay, I think that's all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Any last words from my dear hubby? Keep watching and uh, leave comments. <laughs> oh my god, we can sell like an ad now. Oh, and the outro of all my videos is uh, made by. Julian. Yes. He composed and recorded his guitar playing. Yes, I do play guitar. And he only watched the last 10 seconds of my video just to listen to his own playing. You have anything to say about that? Leave a comment if you want to do the show as well. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, okay, that's all. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys next time. Bye. Mm -hmm.